here we are. We've got the, the brand new gin cake. This guy's brought it up today. It's a new type of foil. And uh, it's kind of like a single skin hybrid foil kite. So, as you can see, it's kind of like got a, a foil type leading edge and single skin in the back. Um, this has been done before actually, it's not something new. I've seen this before. And uh, I flew it actually for a little while and basically it's crap! It's a heap of shit. Doesn't fly, no power. It's just honestly the worst possible foil you can possibly get. The guy picked it up for $500 got ripped off. It's honestly, it's a, I don't know why people make these kites and put them on the market when they don't fly. They, they, no power, fucking useless piece of crap. And I'm sure they're quite expensive. I mean, I imagine in 25 knots you get something out of it. But uh, we're flying in what, maybe 12, 14 knots. People are flying 10 meter inflatables. And I'm on a 15 powered up. And uh, this is a 9 meter and I couldn't even get going. So the gin, I don't know what it's called. Gin crap, I think. But yeah. If you ever decide to get one of these kites, don't. Unless it's like really cheap, like, you know, a hundred dollars, then it's like, you know, why not? But, um, no, I don't know what these kite companies are doing, but um, they, they've done it before. Fly 7 did the same thing. They produce crap, basically, and they sell it, and people buy it. You know, you know it's like, you can't do that to people. You're ripping people off. Don't do it. Honestly, it drives me crazy. Anyway, I had a good day today.